Hello Virgo and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of November 7th and this is a quick and general reading. Okay, the past is showing up here. Either it's reminiscing the past or past like love relationship for some of you, okay? Or your desire. So I do feel that energy, all right? So there is that it's almost like you didn't care then or there's been changes of feelings um, seeing that. Okay, let's take a look here. You have a new beginning with finances. I want to say something of value. This is also showing up as, hold on, let me see. Okay. Um, this is also showing up as you're growing as a person. There is part of in something in your life that you are growing as a person. Um, I do see this is kicking off an addiction or some kind of um, bad habit. Saw that with another sign. Hmm. Um, there is a reason to celebrate here. Maybe this is a new job offer or some kind of, um, I don't know, this could be a peace offering for some. Interesting, okay? But I see some kind of a celebration. The base of your energy definitely here I do see is um, this is a week of the past. Is there something about the past that's connected even with money? All right, I do see this is a week of this could be you getting some gifts or you give uh, gifting or um, you may, some of you may um, purchase a luxury item or an expensive item. I do feel that energy money from the past, it could be questioned. For some of you, it's good or bad, meaning maybe you owe the IRS. Maybe um, there's bills to pay. For others of you, you're just kind of, um, I don't know. These are expenditures that are going to benefit you later. So I do see that breaking free from a financial obligation is showing up for some of you, Okay. There is um, a focus on real estate. Um, so if you're into real estate, it could be doing well. A lot of you, thoughts of buying or purchasing or thoughts of moving. So I do see that energy, okay? There is a, ch a change in of direction with career and work or job or something is kind of changing in that area, okay? I do see energies around you. There's a, it's like an air sign energy, Gemini uh, Leo, there are some things that you may process or you're going through some kind of purging or changes in the next couple weeks, I feel. All right. So that is showing up. You're going to be done emotionally with um, something that you're going to be. Um, this could be a relationship or something in your life that you're moving uh, forward with. Don't assume things, though. Because not everything and things are not quite the way you think they'll be, okay? Or they weren't the way that you thought it'll be, okay? You will be kind of organizing, getting things under control, getting things, uh, things will fall into place too. But I think you're going to be kind of um, organizing some things. I do see a lot more clarity. This is a light bulb moment coming through or it's a new way of thinking, okay? Um, expect some changes. These are quick, sudden changes, I want to say. Um, abrupt changes. So I do see that as, as well. I do see for some of you with love, this is, are you going to commit to love? You know, um, maybe there's talks about it. Um, this could be to some of your goals. There is a reassessment here too. I do see a new beginning here with love. This is a, a relief, um, some kind of emotional validation as well. Okay. Now, I do see for some of you, there is a love offer coming through. This is um, also talk, advice, can be a water sign energy, but this person can give you some kind of, um, emo I don't know, emotional advice or uh, love advice. Some of you, this is maybe talk therapy. I don't know. I do see that um, energy. For some of you, this is a person coming in. Can be a water sign. It's a, there's a strong water energy or someone from the past. I don't know. I am seeing that kind of energy. Definitely seeing you dealing with uh, love this week, okay? And maybe some major decisions with love, like, uh-huh. Now, um, this is a good week of contracts. Um, this could be contracts that you've been uh, held up in. It could be because of a past or a connection to a love relationship. I don't know. There is something love and money together. So I'm seeing that is coming into focus. I do see that... Um, Standing your ground is going to be very important this week and perseverance. Don't give up on some things too. But I do see you're going to have to do some kind of soul searching or inner work or kind of a to-do list 
It's like, yes, this applies, this doesn't apply, that kind of energy as well. For some of you, this could be a little bit of challenges at work or competitive energy too, okay? Um, I do see some of you dealing with a a uh, person who may come, uh, words have power. This person may also have a um, blunt form of speech and you also um, know that your words have power and they could have consequences. So I would pick and choose my words wisely this week as well. This is a week where a lot of you are thinking more seriously, uh, more analytical and probably doing really well. If you got like something to do with science or math, should be doing very well. It's coming somehow into focus as well. I do see messages may be coming through too. You may be stressed a little about something that you hear, but remember, not everything is what you think. Um, I do see here there's some regrets, worries, that kind of energy too, but you're overthinking some things as well. This can be related to where you're going to go with a relationship and where you are like home, foundation, what are you building for yourself, okay? So I do see that energy as well. Um, there is a strong energy here, Virgo, that in that moment, you didn't care. Now you do. There's a change, okay? All right. Um, you have some numbers, too. There is 9, 45, 4, and 1. Hmm. They may come into play somehow this week. All right, uh, Virgo, I hope you have a wonderful week. Catch you back next week for our next reading. Bye for now.